like my grandparents, they met in the old country and they had to escape during the war and they weren't even Jewish, they were just paranoid. <laughs> so like, when they got here, like my grandma went to Chicago and my grandpa went to New York. And like all they remember is they, they only spent one day together in the old country. They had met in between classes. And they like completely fell in love. They had like one of those 10 hour days where they got to know each other and really just share everything and really connect. And when she got to Chicago, she would go by the Art Institute because she had told him during that the only place she ever cared about was the Art Institute of Chicago. Neither one of them spoke the language. He learned the language. He got himself to Chicago two years later. And he finally found himself on his first day walking past the Art Institute of Chicago. And she was walking past the Art Institute of Chicago because she did that every day for two years just in case he came. And they fell in love. They had an amazing life together. They have, I think it's like 15 grandkids, 22 great grandkids, and it's just this beautiful story. And now, it's like, oh, how did your grandparents meet? Like, oh, on the toilet. <laughs> yeah, oh my God, I had Indian food the night before, and I'm like, thank God, because I would not have met him and not swipe right. So like, I just, I think we're missing out on uh, Indian food. Um, <laughs>